Aw, cute little ghost. Y you think I'm cute? As a button. <coughs> oh, too much. <coughs> oh, God. Did I scare you? Well, I mean, you startled me out of a dead sleep. <laughs> oh. But a jump scare is still a scare. <gasps> Good job, little ghost. Yay! Uh-uh, little ghost. You are too cute to be in my closet. I know. I just want to watch you and take some scary notes. <sighs> Fine. Just pick something small to haunt that's out of my way, all right? Yes. Moan. <sighs> Moan. <sighs> that was too cute, little ghost. Oh, come on. Dude, being dead sucks. I was literally about to say that. Right? Why don't we just get back in our bodies? How have we never thought to try that? All right, this is me. See you on the other side. This is uh, good for me to know. I do not recommend re-entering your dead body. I can hear the screams all the way up here. My skin burned, my veins burned, my bones burned. It was darkness and torture. I felt no love. And though it lasted only but an instant before I died again, I had time to stress out about my bank account. Oh God, no. Repeat after me. I am scary. I am scary. I am worthy of being feared. I am worthy of being feared. If you don't think I'm scary, I will eat your entire family. If you don't think I'm scary, I will eat your entire f Oh, goodness. If you were uncomfortable saying the previous affirmation out loud, please re-listen to Chapter 3, using hyperbole to get in the scary zone. Oh, shoot. That's right. I gotta say, I always thought when I died, I would suddenly know the truth to all the mysteries of the world. Oh, yeah, dude. Me too. Like, aliens? Or JFK? The moon landing? The moon landing? Yeah, like, we faked it. You know we landed on the moon five more times after the moon landing? I, uh... And did they fake Apollo 13 when they almost died getting to the moon? Can we just focus on the cool part of the conspiracy theory, please? Closet ghost? What's heaven like? Well, I don't know, kiddo. Being a closet ghost, I just assumed I was sent to hell. Cause there are m, -m, -m monsters in there. Hey, little ghost, I'm gonna give my friend a tour of the closet. I need you to make yourself scarce. Oh, come on. You know I have a hard time being scarce. It's really tough for me, but I'm working on it. What? I'm guessing scarce isn't slang for scary. Little ghost, vamoose! Quit using words I don't know! Ah! Whoa, what? <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes I forget we're ghosts. And buddy, we are terrifying. Dude, I am so excited to show you the place I haunt. I've got this sweet closet in this room. Oh, that chair came out of nowhere. What? How did you trip on a chair? We literally float through stuff. Look, buddy, you don't just die and suddenly you have a grip on life, all right? All right. Kicked out of the closet, huh? Yeah, but it's okay. No, it's not. No, it's not. You should make them pay. I will make them pay. I'm just saying, we haunt everywhere. I don't see how hanging out in this closet makes you a closet ghost. <laughs> you haunt that graveyard. I hang out in the graveyard. So do you sometimes. Do you haunt the graveyard? No, I haunt this closet. Blah! Ah! For kicking me out of the closet, I'm making you pay me money. Man, you guys love this goddamn closet. Yesterday I scared someone. Not just someone, but some too. Next time I want to be scary, I know what to do. Come on, Lil Ghost. Way too cute. What do you mean too cute? The kid sounds like a sociopath. What's a sociopath? Get it off of me. Uh-uh. I don't know who needs to hear this, 
But if you want to be scary, then you are scary. Don't let anybody tell you you're cute. I'm looking at you right now, and I'm terrified. Go spook em, tiger. Rawr! Little ghost, little ghost, do you even know you're the cutest ghost out there? Why do you need to scare?